welcome back. You don't need a celebrity body to dress like the stars this summer because John Scott has the perfect outfit for every figure. But first, we're joined by Darren Day, who agreed to be regressed into a past life. Why? I don't know. <laughs> I, I just, um, do you know what it came from, really, was, was when you did Schofield's Quest and... Uh, Oh, God, my manager ago, Russ, yeah. our manager, yeah. Yeah, was um, yeah. was regressed, and I just remember, I just remember him sitting back and going, "Oh yes, oh yes," and, and like speaking in a, in a different well, voice. Well, he turned into a a, 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 a a shipping a shipping tycoon from Bristol. It's the most convincing regression I've ever seen because his facts were unbelievable. Yeah. and yeah. your story here was also extraordinary. It was really, and it's kind of spooky watching that back because the, my biggest fear, and I really thought that they wouldn't be able to put me under. That was that was you know I just didn't think that I'd, some people apparently can't go under, and I didn't mm. think that would do. But well, yeah. you did go under. I did, and, uh, and this is the result. Can you just look down and see if you've got a physical body? I'm a soldier. Which country are you fighting for? Great Britain. And where are you now? I'm on the, I'm on the border of Germany. Mm -hmm. On the border. What year is it? 1917-1917. Do you know what your family name is? What was your family's surname? Wallace. Wallace. What was your first name? My name's Adam. Fane. Mm. Sharp face. My left leg, my right arm. What's happened to your left leg? Bullet wounds. Mm. Who shot you? I don't know which one it was, lots of people. Is anyone looking after you now that you're injured? Is, is there anyone looking after you in this? Nurses. Mm -hmm. Nurses look after us. I like one of the nurses. What's her name? I don't know her name. I don't know her name. Was she kind to you? She's very kind. She, she helped my leg. Hmm? She held my leg. She held your leg. She spoke English. Was she English or not? She told me she was Dutch. I never met a Dutch girl. Go back to the first time when that nurse told you her name. Bluebell. Is that her name? They called her Bluebell. If you know that soul in 2004, it will be shown to you now. I know who she is. Who is it? Suzanne Christine Croshaw. So in this lifetime as Darren, that nurse in 1917 is now your girlfriend, Suzanne. I missed her when she left. She looked after me for three days. She left the... Where did she, she leave to go? Uh, she left the camp. I don't know why. I don't know where. Do you know now what your, your rank and regiment and position was? I fight for king and country, miss. They say we're all on the same side. And do you feel you are all on the same side? No. What makes you feel that you're not all on the same side? What's in people's eyes? Hmm? I see what's in people's eyes. And what is in people's eyes? Insincerity. Mm. Scared out here. Alone. Betrayed. Mostly betrayed. I've killed men. How many men have you killed? I counted until ten. You counted till ten, and then. I don't want to count anymore after ten. Not after ten. 
Did you leave that place where you were in bed? having your wounds tended to. Did you ever leave there? I never went home. It wasn't, it wasn't these wounds that killed me that I have no. What killed you? I lost so, so much noise. So, so much. So many people shouting, crawling on the floor, crawling, screaming. Mm. It's madness. I don't hurt anymore. Where is it that you've gone to that you don't hurt anymore? By the sea now. If you look down, have you got a physical body at all now? No. What are your thoughts upon the war? How do you feel about the war? If you'll pardon my expression, Miss. The war. The war. What did it teach you? Better off where I am. Allow whatever you need to see on a relationship level to be shown to you now. Loyalty. Mm. Loyalty. That's important, isn't it? It's very important. Well, there you go. You've seen the regression. We'll be talking to Darren and Andy.